Hey everybody, what's up? We're back once again for some more Fallout 3 Jack Crackers here. Took a little bit of break, but we are back. I've already used up four stim packs. As you guys saw in the last video, uh, when I left off, I didn't get really far. I probably moved about um, 100 feet, if that. I got attacked by a dog, which was not fun. I can't tell if my colors are still a little messed up from uh, my poor drug usage from before, but continue pushing on nonetheless I got some people here what do you got you want to buy some yes. stuff Gina I have transportation I'm actually uh, I'm good so ooh, oh any, anything here crazy wolf gang welcome sir or madam to crazy wolf gang traveling <laughs> junk store the depot of detritus the shop of slop and the caravan of crap. See, this guy got now, with the times. What odds and ends can I, the craziest of all possible wolf gangs, offer to you? Uh, nothing much. I'm, I'm just here Crazy to sell wolf some gangs stuff. Got just what you need. So let's Assuming go. you need the random junk that I've got. Boom, 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 boom. I don't need a cattle prod. I don't need. I mean, the laser rifle. Don't need a police baton. Don't need a knife. I have a combat knife. Uh, take that. I mean, I have the Ripper. The Ripper is fantastic, but eventually it's going to break. Hopefully I'll get a new weapon by then. Um, I mean, I don't really need all of these, honestly. So I guess we'll say some joints. Um, don't really need the fingers. Everything else is pretty good. 0.32. Anything I can use? Oh, stim packs. Yes, let's go... Uh, rocket launcher. That's really it. All right. Another satisfied customer. Another one. Can I, uh, can I recruit you? Oh, wait, wait, it's opening up. Deputy. Have yourself a nice visit, partner. You're the guy who wants water. I am crippled. Oh, you're right. Oh, can I, uh... Can't sleep here. Now, I think I can actually recruit you, friend. Smiles, companion, recruit. We're not gonna do that. I'm not gonna cheat and give myself everyone as a companion. Just yet. So let's go around here. I think the first person I'm going to, uh, recruit nonetheless will probably be our good old buddy, um, who's the sheriff here. I can't even remember his name, so... I decided to get a recap of what my character looked like there. Howdy. Another newcomer. Name's Lucas Sims, town sheriff, and mayor too, when the need arises. Alright, good deal. Nice time you got your sheriff. Friendly and well-mannered. I think we're gonna get along just fine. You treat my people nice, and you're welcome to stay as long as you'd like. Alright, message received. I'm glad we understand each other. Now, is there something I can help you with? Uh, nothing really right now I'm going to need you for. I think what I am going to do <laughs> is everyone's beloved favorite mission. Uh, I, mean, I guess I probably should ask about Dad. So. Yeah? Actually, do you know, do you, who, do you my father? <laughs> Sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. I'd ask around town. All right. Carry on. Carry on, my wayward son. People, people, people. They got food over there. How is my uh, primary need? You're, you're well rested, you're not thirsty, you're not hungry. It's good to know. Here we are, the, uh, the crater side supply. Moira Brown. What you got going here? I'm just here to make sure nothing goes wrong yep. with you. What would you like to create? Fit power armor, power helmet, toolkit, med kit, med kit, bone saw. Oh yeah, I forgot. It's it's not like New, uh, New Vegas or, or 4 or anything. Hey, so. I hear you're that stray from the vault. Oh, I haven't seen one of you for years. Right. Good to meet you. I'm Moira Brown. I run Craterside Supply. But what I really do is mostly tinkering and research. Say, I'm working on a book about the wasteland. It'd be great to have the foreword by a vault dweller. Help me out, would you? Uh, 
that that's where she get that vault safe from. I'm pretty sure I remember a girl coming into town with that about 10, 12 years ago. She didn't know a thing about the wastes, and I knew she'd get herself hurt without some sort of protection. So I offered to armor her vault suit. Never saw her again. Probably died out there, poor thing. In a way, she gave me the idea to write this book. It's yours if you help. Okay. Great. <gasps> Just tell me what it's like to live underground all your life. Or or to come outside for the first break time. Breaking my that's or not who I am. <laughs> whatever strikes your fancy. Alright. Uh, it was a paradise there until Dan left. The outside place is amazing. I can't even see the seedling. I was sent as ambassador for the Utopia Vault 101. Maybe a little here. I haven't found a food dispenser anywhere. It's kind of dark and food sucks. Good riddance. Uh, how about as ambassador? Oh, certainly, your majesty. Then consider this armored vault suit to be Megaton's gift to your mighty empire. <laughs> However, you may consider going incognito. People around here don't always take kindly to monarchy, you know. Yeah, That'll I be imagine. great for the book. In fact, want to help me with the research? I can pay you, and it'll be fun. That sounds like a wonderful idea, Moira. Um... Let's see, what's this book about? Well, it's a dangerous place out there in the wastes, right? People could really use a compilation of good advice, like a wasteland survival guide. Yep. For that, I need an assistant to test my theories. I wouldn't want anyone to get hurt because of a mistake. Nobody's ever happy when that happens. No, then they just yell a lot at me with mean, mean words. Good enthusiasm! Now, I think the first chapter will have to be about surviving day-to-day -day dangers. Things like where it is and isn't safe to find food, the dangers of radiation, and how to avoid and even profit from dangerous landmines. Ooh, <laughs> sounds like fun, doesn't it? Which do you want to do first? Uh, honestly, let's well, do the radiation that's thing that's what first. I need your help for, so. isn't it? So I need you. Yeah, let's get the poisoning over with. Okay, I'll get her ready and you patch me Jet. up. Oh my gosh, we can get her as a companion. So let's let's go. It's weird. So Fallout Three is one of those games where it's kind of weird because like some of the stuff here, you'd imagine like this, like the desk fan you could pick up. You actually can't in this game. So now she did give me the armored vault suit. Uh, this gives me bonus Christmas guns, though. I'll keep running around with this for the time being. All right, let's get, let's get the uh, the pain over with. For, oh, hmm. Let those who dwell here I'm gonna drink that water. So then you get the two uh, two hundred and then six hundred. So I'm already I'm already in this thing right now. Come forth. And drink the waters of the glow. For this ancient weapon of war is our salvation. This guy must think I'm like the greatest thing since sliced bread if I'm around here. Just start drinking it. I don't know how these guys don't die. Radiation 654, so I did it. And then we'll probably go back to the child of Adam, dude. Alright. Where are you at, Moira? Oh, feeling a bit under the weather? Or a bit over the Geiger counter? Stop it. Stop. Your jokes are as bad as mine. I'm about as ready as I can get without burning a hole in the floor. You got there, right? I can tell. You're positively glowing. Now, just hold on and try not to move. Uh, I feel fine. Coughing or bear in a problem. Oh, you poor dear. Putting on a brave face like that. Well, don't worry. It'll all be better. And it's for a good cause. Now, let me take a few notes, and I'll handle that nasty radiation with a bit of my own homemade rad cure concoction. I've well, never had a that. chance to test it out on someone so heavily dosed. Oh, but, but I'm sure it'll work out fine. Exciting, isn't it? Okay, a little Brahmin milk, a couple magnets, and maybe a few happy thoughts. A few happy thoughts. Well, you're alive! Oh, that's the good news. But there was a little side effect. A teeny tiny, um, mutation. Of course. Here, take a few radiation chems. As my little way of saying, I'm sorry I twisted your DNA like a kitten with a ball of yarn. 
Uh, rad regeneration perk added. Moist experience. Unexpected side effect. Now when you suffer from advanced radiation poisoning, Cripple Limbs automatically regenerate. That's actually pretty good. Let's continue I've with the next to... chapter. I need someone to... And that'll cover the first section. We're going to go through and uh, we're going to get the food. Well, food I love and this medicine. little part. So. Everyone needs them once in a while, right? So they need a good place to find them. There's an old super duper mart not far from here. I need to know if a place like that still has any food or medicine left in it. Alright, go to the super duper mart. I I've seen my folder. My I've got my eye on you too. Uh, yeah, so I'm still injured. So I'm probably going to have to go check out the doctors down here. I imagine sleeping won't, uh, won't heal all my problems, sadly. Yeah? You need something? No, I don't need anything. <laughs> I'm Doc Church, and I run this clinic. Now, before your face you go asking your, me for help, you'd better your know Your arms rules. don't match, brother. Rule one, don't bother me. If you do bother me, you better be damn near dead. I'm busy enough taking care of people I actually love. That's nice. Follow my rule. Keep me patched up, Mr. Patches. I'm so Alright. You all right me. up there? Need another painkiller? Yeah, see, look at that. All better now. Uh, yeah, that's it. Thanks, champ. So, I'm at full health. Full radiation. Got stim packs on me. What's up? You. Oh, you're think, hey, Jericho. You're actually a bad person, aren't you? I think. Um. All right. Yeah. Let's continue along. We're gonna do the super duper mart thingy, which I may regret. Let's start making our way over there. I can barely take on the raiders when they're. Over there, so I don't know how in the world I'm gonna take over uh, the super duper mart. I actually, let me check what's my repair skill here. My repair skill is 26. I imagine I can actually fix it. No, I'm not looking for you. I'm looking for the mayor or the sheriff. Where's the uh, the waste treatment thing? Are you it here? Wait. Can I talk to you? Walter. Yeah, what is it? Uh what can I do to help around here? Well, it's no secret that the old water treatment plant is on its last legs. And I'm the only one in town that can keep the damn thing running. I spend so much time up in the plant that I can't take care of the leaks that keep springing up in the pipes around town. We got you, don't now, I don't expect much from strangers, but if you've got the know-how, I need someone to hunt down and repair those leaks. From the pressure check along the pipes and the valves but they might be a bit tricky to spot uh, all right let's go fix them so I don't think it actually popped up as a mission though did it yeah so let's go here I remember seeing this one Pair thirty, of course. Whatever. All right, let's continue. Uh, let's continue out of here. Back to the capital wasteland, as they call it. Find medicine in the super duper mart. We're gonna find some food. All that will actually help me out, anyway, because I'll be needing that eventually. Welcome. Yeah, I don't know what it is. Like it's like there's like like the tint of it looks weirder than normal, honestly. So I haven't installed any fancy graphical mods honestly so I wouldn't be surprised I remember old time playing on the Xbox 360 this little area right here I actually used to be like hovering so but the game worked at the end of the day so thanks there Fallout so where is it super duo No, 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 I don't think so. Heard you coming up right behind me. Super Duper Mart. Is that it down there? No, I don't think... Is that the one? Maybe it just hasn't loaded yet. I 
Yeah, there we go. Now it's loaded. There's the Super Duper Mario. So, I'm going to save it here, everybody. And next episode, we're going to go into the Super Duper Mario. Try not to get killed a million times. Alright, everyone. Peace out.